Now, this is a funny little film, and the only reason I mention it, as you know, in Hollywood or these days, very often they pay the star slightly less, but they get a percentage of the profits. Now, this was not done in England, but this funny little film, because it's very hard for small people, small productions to make films, they're so expensive. So this particular production, and I don't know, do you have Lovejoy in America? No, it's a, Ian McShane was quite a small part actor. We had your beautiful Texan, Gail Honeycutt, lovely lady. And of this film, because they didn't have much money, they suggested that would everybody, including the unit, like to have their normal wage, but all the overtime would be a percentage of the profits. And everybody agreed, except me. Because I had a mortgage and I had expenses. Well, we worked another location film because the unions had been making so much trouble and making it really difficult for production people. They were starting to work on location and eventually they went abroad. So we had overtime because when you're not at a studio, you can go on filming all day, you can go on filming all evening. There's no union person to say you've got to stop. So we did so much overtime, I made an absolute fortune. The only one who did, because sadly, the film was never released. I think it might have been released 20 years later, but it was never released. Because isn't it sad? You make a film, it might cost you a lot of money, even if it's a cheap production, and when you've finished it, all you've got left is a few cans of film. You haven't got a studio, you haven't got a shop or equipment, you've got nothing except these cans of film. And until you manage to sell it and get it shown, it's worthless. And so this lovely little production, and we had a really lovely time on it, completely and utterly died a death, and nobody got any percentage. I think by the time they put it on this, this DVD, everybody who'd been on it was probably dead, I'm not sure. <laughs>